What's going on everybody? Today we are gonna be going over fall essentials at the mall. Yes, it's always sir. good to get inside the store, see what's new, trying some new clothes. I say we get right into it. Next level. The first store we are gonna be hitting up is Zara, right? Really great for affordable essentials, especially for the fall. Really great way to layer up. Yes, sir. All right, let's go see what they have. So the first thing that caught my eye when it came to Zara were these like kind of like thicker, they're almost like jackets with lining, flannels. But, oh, you know, yeah, okay. All right, guys, so as far as Zara goes, we ended up getting kicked out, so we had to buy everything. But later on, we'll show you at the office what we ended up getting. All right, so I just came across some flannels right here. Out of all these flannels, I would say the best one has to be this one. Actually, this one's not bad. Flannels, $39.90. Just wanted to show you what they had here. All right, you guys, so I know you guys are always commenting about the this like Heather oatmeal hoodie that I always kind of rocked. Not Uniqlo, but if you guys come over here, they actually offer a pretty similar version and a crew neck and also a zipper hoodie. Definitely very neutral, goes with pretty much any shoes you're wearing, any jeans. If you guys want something similar to the one I always wear, definitely check out Uniqlo, $29.90. All right, so I just saw this uh, jacket right here. Gonna try it on. What's really cool about this one is if you look closely, it almost has like a brown with a blue hue to the material and it looks like it would be itchy, but it's not. It's actually really soft. All right, I take that back. Inside the sleeves, actually really itchy. All right guys, so I know it's a fall essentials video, but man, the shorts right here do not sleep on these. They kind of give me this like Lululemon vibe and they are only 19 bucks, all right? The quality does seem on point on these shorts. They have a bunch of colors, black. You even got this like peppered gray right here. So definitely check these out. All right guys, so right now we are in the Chino section, all right? They have skinny fit and they also have the regular fit right here. For myself, I prefer this darker khaki color opposed to the light one. I think it's just a little bit more unique, more everyday. The light khaki kind of looks like you're about to go on to a board meeting or something like that. So yeah, definitely the darker khaki for me. Huge shout out to Uniqlo. Always really cool about letting us film there, man. Always support Uniqlo. Sheesh, speaking of fall essentials right here, oh, the man. pumpkin spice handcrafted shape. We're lucky no one's working, okay? It says oh. we'll return, what, after 12, oh, oh, we got four minutes, we gotta get out of here, man. Get out of here before we order this, man, right? That, I bet you that has 2,000 calories. Let's get out of there. All right, guys, so right now we are in Vans, checking out what they got. This is kind of funny. The OG Simpsons, when they looked all weird. That's actually kind of cool, opposed to the newer Simpsons. Very true, very true. All right, so little challenge here. Uh, we get to pick one sneaker. What is it gonna be? Okay, all right, cool. You, you do one for me. I'll pick one. And I'll pick one for you. Oh, okay. All right, cool, let's do that. All right, so what would Tan like? He would like these if they were leather. I used to love rocking these. Just a nice plain classic white on white old schools. Sometimes you gotta switch it up from the white on whites, okay? The nice little dash of color makes a huge difference. Look at that, still a classic shoe. All right, Tan, so my pick here at Vans for you would be these right here, the leather old schools. But, you know, you used to like the all white ones a lot, but with the red stripe, you can't That's go funny. bad. That is funny because I actually brought these up right here. There you go. Sometimes you need a little switch up, but you don't want to go too far away from the classic. Mm. But I got you the classic. White, white on white right here. White. These are dope because they used to only be in clothing exclusives. Yep. Like you could only get them from like the higher end boutique websites. Very true. And now they sell them directly at Vans. So for true. 65 bucks, you definitely can't go wrong with these. I feel like these are like a skate version of the all white Air Force Ones oh, kind of like, for sure. I would put for it in sure. that category. North Face Gucci collab coming soon, but it's not there yet. So oh. not gonna check it out. Not gonna check oh. it out. All right, here at Nordstrom, they have the 1.0s. Can you have the cream ones cream on right here? The white one is clean. I'm not gonna lie, man. Seeing them in person? Still garbage. Hey! What's up, man? Hey! What's the cheese of the day? Cheese sticks right here. Cheese sticks? Right here? All right, guys, so we're just walking around a fan 
that works at Beecher's Cheese has told us to try out their new mm. cheese stick right here. Wow, so, uh, this is not your ordinary regular cheese stick right here, all right? This is uh, made from Seattle. Oh my wow. gosh. That is a Beecher's handmade cheese. Wow, perfect. Flavor is perfect, not too strong. All yeah. right, man, one thing I want to say is, uh, <laughs> If we see you guys working at a spot, it's okay. You do not have to give us free food. Yo. I don't want the fans getting in trouble, man. I see my man's over there getting, getting yelled at. Getting yelled at by his manager, manager, probably. He's over here trying to say, you know, hey, man, they're my friend. <laughs> what did he say to his manager? But yeah. Oh, man. Happens a lot, man. You happens appreciate a lot. It. We appreciate it. But, you know, we don't want to get y'all in trouble. But, uh, it's okay. We don't need the free cheese, all right? <laughs> don't risk your job for the free cheese. Hey, but we I'm, appreciate it, though. Tan's the type to walk past the store and just know he's going to get noticed so he can get some free food. All right, guys. So we just got back to the office. We ended up getting kicked out of Zara. <sighs> so what we ended up doing is picking out a bunch of items that we would have showed you guys in the store. And we're just going to show them to you guys right Let's now. Let's do it. All right, so this one right here, man, Ooh. fire. This caught my eye, obviously, the pattern, right? It's not, you know, typical camo. You can't categorize this. That kind of reminds me of what you would see something from, like, Stone Island or, like, a Supreme North Face collaboration. Ooh. And the price was 89 Although it is steep, I was taking a look at it before we uh, set up. Details are crazy. Details are great. Yeah. And it fits dope. The yeah, fit it is. is dope. It's got extra little toggles and draw cords. And in my opinion, when it comes to this jacket, I would actually prefer it without the branding of North Face. Sometimes with the North Face, you might get like too much of a uh, outdoorsy um, hiking it's, vibe. Uh, when it comes to North Face, I think it's more mainstream. You're yeah. not going to catch a lot of people with the Zara jacket. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. So I, I really like this jacket right here. It was uh, 89 bucks. My bad. Quality is really good, um, and the fit is really good. All right, so this one right here, kind of like a uh, flannel jacket lining right here is insane and we're just talking about quality they went the extra mile for this type extra of stitching, stitching. Yes. i don't even know what this is called it even has the stitching on the outer shell of the jacket oh on the flannel part yeah so color how, palette crazy this one's really comfortable actually 69 bucks and you know what it is i think i used to put zara in a lower tier price point but it's not that cheap, I was actually. just going to big him up. Yeah. I was just going to big him up. I, like, I don't remember Zara being this good. Mm -hmm. So they probably stepped yeah, it up for I think sure. stepped it up. All right. What else we got? Okay. You this picked this out. You I picked, picked this out. out. This crazy comfortable. Yep. Yep. You were definitely big up on that. this is not sponsored. This is not sponsored. We're no. literally telling you this stuff is comfortable. So this jacket I picked because um, when it comes to a poofer jacket, right? A puffer Ooh. jacket. I don't like it when it makes you look like a Michelin man. Mm. If that makes sense. Where like the, the North Too faces. much. Yes. The those, North are, faces, those are thick. Too much down. There's too mm. much down in those North Face jackets. This is like a nice slim. You it's not that it heavy. Yeah, I'll put it on right now. All right. So I don't feel like stuffed. Yeah, especially sense. you have a sweatshirt underneath. Yeah, and it's any still other feels jacket slim. you would be like, you know. No, I, I get that feeling with the North Face jackets all the time, but with mm -hmm. the Zara one, I really I like it a lot. Yeah, price point uh, is, 89 uh, bucks. 89, 89 bucks. decent amount of down, still gonna keep you warm, mm -hmm. and the, the shell's pretty good too. Yeah. All right, what else we got? This Kinda, was interesting. I, yeah. This one was interesting. Uh, Border Warrior button right here kind of throwing me I'm not going to lie. Yeah. I passed up on this piece a lot, but it doesn't look that bad now that I really just look at it. With the hoodie underneath or something? Black hoodie? Ooh. You can do anything you want when you say Sometimes you just got to switch up the the taste. You know, now, this is not going to be your ordinary uh, thing in your wardrobe. You only got the hounds too with the corduroy. And it looks like it would be super itchy and whatnot. It's it's actually not. Wow. Woo! Price point crazy. What? Over 100? 119. This is definitely not essential, but, you know, if you want this look, I just wanted to show you guys. Yeah. All right. Lastly, we got two pieces right here. What we got? Oh. Okay. So we got a flannel, very soft. This one is a relaxed fit. I mean, this screams just fall. All the colors, you got all the tones, mm -hmm. but a splash of red. And this flannel is 49 bucks. It kind of reminds me of some of the uh, colors that we saw at Uniqlo, but quality wise, I would say I like it. I like it more. Yeah. It's, it's way thicker. Right. And then we got this. Uh, looks like a like a worksman type mm -hmm. of button up. You got the big signature pockets Casual over here. Box. Nice. Uh, um, tortoise buttons. Yep. 
casual vibes. Almost like a uh, worn look to the fabric, too. I was too. just going to talk about the fabric. It doesn't look like super dressed up or anything. This is this is that John Mayer, yes. you know, rock with the uh, light distress denim look, unions vibe. If this piece had any different fabric, the vibes would be totally off. Yeah. It'd be different. Yeah, this is, a, this is nice. Yeah, this so nice right relaxed here. fit, too. So you're going to get that little boxy, you know. Yeah, 45 bucks right there. Nice. Don't Easy begin. season boots right here, man. Look. Their boot section is not bad. You guys have seen me recommend some boots from there yeah and then good thing about yeezy boots there's not a lot of branding on it so no, yeah. the the look is a uh, pretty spot on when it comes to the zara ones. nice sand color 89 bucks they run huge so keep that in mind but yeah these aren't bad at all all right so uh yeah we just wanted to show you what we ended up getting at zara some of the pieces how much they were some of the fits and whatnot yes, make sure you guys check them out as well as the other stores that we showed you guys uh this is not sponsored we just wanted to show you some of the pieces because we got kicked out. Oh, yeah, for sure. All right. Peace.